Hi, my name is Patrick, and welcome back to my first playthrough of the game Control. Today, we are, as usual, going to pick up right where we left off last time. We were in the maintenance sector, and had just gotten the ability to kind of float around and had gotten back to the main area. And now we're going to see where things take us next. Do I need to reconfigure that? I don't think so. Okay, so we got to fix the energy converters. So we're going to go this way. If I can remember how to even float. Or change my gun. Okay, we got the... The different... Rotary gun this time, so we're going to try that out for a little while. Things are overheating and it is not good, and there are floaty people everywhere. Alright, energy converters. There we go. Oh, that's a big one. That's not good. Uh... No, uh, that's not good either. Uh, what was my controls again? Jeepers. You don't play for a little bit and you completely forget how to do things. Big gun, go. Okay, I need to remember my controls really quick. Every single time I do this. <clears throat> I don't play for a week and then I'm like, oh wait, what am I supposed to do? Melee, sweet, use shield, launch, E. There we go, thank you. Okay. Now I remember. Thanks, come here. Let's play with friends, shall we? Boxes don't do a lot, but you know, it might help. What, you can fly now? Great. Come here. Son of a gun. Thank you. Whoa. Hello. Where'd that come from? Anybody else want to play? We good? I can hear you. Flitting around somewhere. Maybe not. Oh, there you are. You know what? Be gone. Uh, sorry, bud. Rough times for you. Alright, energy converters. That's where I'm supposed to go next. Is energy converters. Ooh, that's not good. Big noises. We need to fix this thing ASAP. I'm working on it. Just be patient, please. Hello, friends. Oh, you're not friends. Reloading, reloading, reloading. Here, have a pallet in the face. Oh, that didn't work. That worked. Oh, there's more. Okay. Uh, ow, 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 ow. Give me something to throw. There we go, thanks. Need to kill people using launch, so... Come here, big thing. Ah, come here. There, thanks. Okay. Are we actually done now? Yes. Control point happy. Okay, thanks. Yes, cleanse the control point, please. Okay. That's certainly funky looking. Can I go past this? Oh. Oh. Oh, that's a lot of hiss. Okay, so that's bad hiss. Maybe I can destroy all the bad hiss? Nope, nope, nope. Can't go in there. Okay. It was worth a try. Alright, now that we are happy up there. Hello. It's fried up. You need to fix it before the old trick man's inside the plant has a shit fit. I'm working on it. Hey friendos, how you doing? 
Let's just have a little throw at you. The energy converters, yes, we know. Wait, where did you go? You walked that way? Oh, you walked that way. Okay, here you go. Thanks. Anybody else want to play? I got a trash can. With your name written all over it. Here's, have a chair. Have a seat. <laughs> I like that. Have a seat. Uh, where'd your other friend go? Did anyone hang out at the water cooler? No? Thought I made a friend. Okay, I guess not. Phew! Oops. Oh, there is a friend up there. Hold on. Where are you? There. That worked. Anybody else? No. Oh, oh, oh. Where'd you go? There you are. Here. There. Leave me be. Hmm, there's another one over there. I know there is. Oh, there's a lot of other ones now. Okay. Good hit. Deserves another. There we go. Okay. I know there's one more. There you are. Okay, are we done here? Okay, thank you. Ritual impulse. Okay. More assets. Cool. Current mission. We did that, yes. Fix the energy converters and burn the trash around the furnace, which we'll have to do later. Lots of personal mods. Evade. Energy cost goes down. Oh, how do I evade again? <laughs> See again, I'm, I'm like not remembering how I can do things. Evade. Evade was control. Okay. That's right. <clears throat> I can leap with it. Hello, anybody in here? You all safe? Probably not. Nobody here. Okay. More impulses of the ritual nature. Okay, oh, we need... Who that? Oh shit. Ooh! Good thing I looked up the control button. I could have ended very poorly. You quite done over there? There you are. Where? Are. Let's not fall down the giant pit of death. I hear you. I hear you. Um, so how do I open this? Can I open this? Do I need to open this? Be the better question, I suppose. Oh, okay, we need an energy cube there, so let's go take care of that real quick. Come to me, energy cube. We must cube you to your home. Hey, that's two of three, now I just gotta do three of three. Oh, shit. Come on, where'd you go? I know you're there. There you go. Is that a biggin? What is that? Why is that? Oh, that's my energy. Never mind. Just for a second, I was confused. Alright. Let's go lift the lockdown. Yeah, let's. Um, first, I need to get a few things, though. Namely, getting over there would be good. Can I get in? It's, it seems to imply I can. Hmm. Something I can jump on top of, perhaps? 
That seems like a good route to get there. Hold on. No, no, no. Jump on top of it. No, it only wants to jump over it. Okay. Um. Hmm. There we go. Okay, thank you. Damage boost, yay. Let's take a look at, whoops, my, that's not the button, that's the button, there we go, okay. We've got a damage boost to 27% versus 23, definitely take the 27%. Let's go ahead and deconstruct the 23%. Ammo refund chance. I think that's what I have on the... Oh, no, no. Put that on there. There we go. Oh, accuracy. That's right. Okay. Um, this clearance level 2, right. We did that. Internal lockdown and emergency security measure is stopping Jesse from looking for trenches. Mission management team and the other sectors. Jesse sets out to enter the maintenance sector. With Adi's help, Jesse reaches the maintenance sector where the internal lockdown can be lifted. She helps the chief of security, Arish, to stabilize the overlying NSC power plant before performing the directorial override and unlocking the sector elevator. I'd like to do burn the trash. So let's see if I can't figure out where to go for that. Excuse me. Or am I? I'm over there. Okay. <clears throat> Is there really nothing? Oh, that's the entrance area, so that explains. Okay. Okay, yeah, there's, there's a lot I can't do here yet. All right. That's fine. We don't have to do those things. The hum of power is definitely becoming a thing. All right. Oh, there's an elevator here. Hello. Upcoming game reminder. Upcoming game reminder. Here we go. Next game is Wednesday at 8, usual spot. Hazard owes me $20. Arish still on a fucking winning streak. Someone please figure out how he's cheating. Thompson suspended for a game because of that shady dealing incident. Guy, I owe you 60. Brought beers last time, so it's Heppenstall's turn. Remus. Electricity level and water levels are both good. <clears throat> oh, we're in the control room all of a sudden. Okay. Cool. Oh, hello. How you doing? <laughs> Reload. Thank you. Oh, behind me. Where are you? There you are. Whoops. That thing really is a lot of DACA without a lot of actual, like, effectiveness. <clears throat> okay. Are you happy now? We can cleanse this, we can get everything back to normal, sort of. Hooray! The irony of having a control room inside of the control room. No. The lockdown can only be lifted by a directorial override. Maybe it's not a good idea to lift the lockdown? This is know. what we came here to do. This is what we came here to do, but now I want to watch the new hotline item on... Internal lockdown, is this it? So much is expected from the director. The responsibility. 
the privilege to steer the Bureau into dangerous waters and safely out again. To inspire and lead its people, to protect them. The board is there to advise you, but they want things in return. You hold all this in your old, trembling hands. I had to lose everything before I could see the Bureau is the Director's life. There's no room for anything else. If the forces contained here escaped, we'd be dragged back into an age of superstition, terror, death. Assuming you think we ever really left that behind. Any emergency, any major containment breach, and the lockdown goes into effect. I implemented this security measure in my first years as director. I knew we were vulnerable. I'd personally seen the cost of sloppiness. I made sure the internal lockdown could only be lifted by a directorial override only to be used when the director is confident the sectors are safe to be opened again. This way, the director is the last line of defense. And if I screw up, it's on me and me alone. See, so that implies that maybe we shouldn't leave, like, lift the lockdown. I don't know. That's, that's a bit of a, yeah, I don't know. Shatter has close range, prefer spin, I don't know. I don't know. Just looking around to see if there's anything else here, okay. Sector elevator, yeah. Point of control, uh-huh. All right, let's just let's just do it. Consequences be damned, it's what the game wants us to do. Here, have gun, we'll lift lockdown. Yay. That's it. The other sector should be open now. I think it's time I told Emily why I'm here. I'll risk it. Okay. You two should get to know each other. You too, huh? Oh, okay. Yeah. I'd like to get to know Emily, sure. What could possibly go wrong? We're going upstairs now, okay. Previously locked door, now unlocked. Thank you. Ventilation, janitor's office, where are we? Oh, we're by the control room doors. Okay, so I didn't um, clear the trash out. I guess we need to do that part still. Oh, this is just the upstairs. Okay, yeah, we've been here before. All right. Uh, right. Let's fast travel to oh, board countermeasures. What? Oh, yes, we finished this. Cool. Thank you. Spin maneuvers. What? Oh, okay. I'm I'm getting a little confused here because it's not actually Hold on a second. Okay, there we go. Kill enemies with a service weapon in pierce mode. Using pierce, I don't have that. Kill his troopers. Um, sure. Kill his rangers in maintenance. Executive, kill executive using shatter. Ah, uh, sure, that's fine. I want to fast travel to the power plant. Please. Okay. 
So I'm gonna check in with our friend over here and see how things are going. What's your read on all this? Hey. Oh, I never went over here. Hello. How y'all doing? Having a good time? Yeah, we're all fine. All right, hey there. Crew feels a lot safer when you're around. Yeah, sure. Okay, nothing new to say. Never mind. I should be going. Right. You got uh, locked down the lift. I already did it. Uh oh. Uh, it wants me to. What's the What's the quest? It wants me to clear the. Uh, burn trash around the furnace in the maintenance sector. Okay. So is this the furnace? Elevator, central maintenance. Oh, hello. Ah, oh, jeepers. Why'd you all get big all of a sudden? I'm just killing these things in one hit. Okay. <clears throat> Who needs any of this when you have more DACA? Right? Here, have an engine block. It's good for you. Okay, but what's the trash that I'm supposed to clear? That's where I'm uncertain what it's talking about. Like, the furnace? What are we looking for? Is that the trash? Like, I don't want to... These people are kind of gone right here, aren't they? Hmm, I don't know. Furnace chamber. Okay, let's head to the furnace chamber. Maybe that's that's specifically, explicitly where I need to be going is the furnace chamber. Coolant pumps. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Nope, nope. I just did that. <clears throat> it would be nice if you didn't have to commit to jumps because that was a mistake. Oops. That's fine. We're fine. We're all fine here. Okay. Just gotta go to the furnace. Cool it pumps. Yes, but there was signage for the furnace, right? Maybe the furnace is this way. Elevator. Ventilation. Yeah, more elevator. Central maintenance. Energy converters. It's this furnace chamber this way. Coolant pumps. So where's the furnace? That's where I'm confused. Um... Something up here? I didn't actually go up here before. Hello friend. How you doing? Hope you're chill. Where is the furnace? So there's pull coolant pumps and uh, maybe that's the whole like separate area above? Because I haven't tried going up. Yeah, furnace chamber this way, right? It's like, okay, I went this way, but then what? Where's the actual furnace? You know? And 
and then this brings me back around to the front. Okay, so I don't... Yeah. I Maybe I can't get to the furnace chamber yet. There's an elevator there. There's an elevator there. There's elevators over there. There's whole sections I haven't actually been to. Um, maybe I just can't go there yet. Oh, I haven't been this way. Yeah, sure. That was a big one. I don't think I've actually been this way, so let's go this way. Central maintenance, okay. Oh, look, bathrooms. Open, please. Thank you. A state of fire booze, spin rate, and dodge efficiency. Okay. Oh, this is a bigger bathroom. We don't actually run into those very often. Hello? Hello? I don't like you hissing in my- what the- Yeah, no hissing in my bathroom allowed. Cut that out. Stop it. No hissing. Like a speaker in there. Okay, sure. Oh, there's like a wall of hiss or something? Oh, I see. It's just gonna be like, no, you can't go this way. Or something. Thresholds. Okay. Uh, thresholds, thresholds, thresholds. There it is. So, uh, examination of paranatural topics. Thresholds. The oldest house is a place in flux. Thresholds appear with no warning. What the threshold will contain is a question we can only answer once it manifests. The widely accepted theory is that the thresholds are dimensions vibrating on an frequency different from our own. When these frequencies match, the threshold will manifest in the oldest house, which acts as a... Mm. Others theorize thresholds are parallel universes, or possibly our own reality at a different point in time. Some believe our collection of altered materials affects the house or attracts the thresholds. We do know for certain that thresholds are not permanent. Eventually their frequency will shift. Some believe Earth itself is just another threshold connected to the oldest house, which is actually rooted in some other reality. This theory, while impossible to disprove, causes it in those who learn of it, so is actively denied. Refer to file 5 05 a 8814 full report. Kill his troopers. Kill his rangers. Kill his rangers, okay. Burning trash. Okay, so... Black rock processing. I'm just, like, exploring at this point. I don't know where any of this stuff is. Turbine room. Can't go there. Hmm? Delays caused by house shifts do not count towards overtime. Well, that's bullcrap. I can't help it if things aren't where they're supposed to be. Hello. A good defense. Investigate the training course. Okay. Let's take a look at what that says. A good defense. Jesse learns of another object of power, a safe, in the field ob training obstacle course. Okay. Uh, home safe tests. Utilization of paranatural elements, munitions testing on OOP-22, a.k.a. home safe. The safe object of power can produce a barrier using objects or materials from its immediate vicinity. See OOP-22 case file for more details. Bureau Rangers were given permission to employ heavy weaponry against a para-utilitarian bound to this object in order to gauge the barrier's durability. Mm, and mm, velocity ammunition were tested with mm, results. Testing will continue after mm. The safe object of power is clearly a viable candidate for use in combat response scenarios, allowing para-utilitarians to participate in altered engagements be an advantage worth considering. Refer to file 8-53-8367 for full report. 
All right, then. So... There's a safe somewhere that I suppose I need to get. Where does this hallway go? Hello. All the goodies. Tenson report warning. Okay. Tennyson, listen, Trench is on the warpath about this Tennyson report thing. He wants to know who wrote it, and he wants to know yesterday. Whoever did is going to get crucified. I don't know if it was one of the you guys, and I don't want to know. I'm not super keen on leading a witch hunt, so tell everyone in the sector to keep their heads down. Best not to be on anyone's radar right now, you know. I tell ya, not even counting all the weird shit we deal with, this place can be a downright hostile work environment sometimes. Hey. Okay. Beep beep. Beep beep. Beep 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 beep. <clears throat> okay, Atlas show. Ooh, hello. Oh. I certainly hope those don't come down crushing on me. Whoa. Nice. That can't be good. Will it open for me, or am I stuck here forevermore? Um. Okay. Yeah, it certainly seems solid. It's not, though! <laughs> well, I had to try. <clears throat> Guess I can't go that way yet, or I need some other ability. I don't know, but that, that does bump me back a little ways. I have to run back over there now. Bummer. I should probably spend some of this XP I've been gathering before I, you know, lose it. Um, okay. I don't have those things. Okay. Um, so I want to use astral constructs? Yeah, weapon forms. Upgrade grip. I don't have enough source and I don't have enough ritual impulse. Okay. I can make mods. Upgrade to enable higher tier mods. Um, yeah, that would probably be useful. Obscured personal mod. Oh, I see. It's just random mods. That's the problem, though, is that, like, I'm, I'm spending money just on mods that won't do anything for me, right? Yeah, and I, I can't upgrade any of these because I don't have any um, that stuff. Okay. Need more personal mod slots. Okay, we gotta do some running. Let's take a look at where we are. We're going this way. Yes, indeed. Wee! Oh, of course they're gonna respawn. Thing doesn't hurt worth anything. Oh, hi there, how are you doing? Okay. More ritual impulses gathered, so that's good. Maybe I have enough now. Alright, yeah, central maintenance. This is where I wanted to go. To field training. Although we went to black rock processing first. Um, I can't go to field training because there's a hiss thing blocking the way. I can go to the sector elevator, which I guess is what gets me in and out of here. Um, okay, yeah. That makes sense. But I don't want to go that way right now. Not yet. Um... And I'm guessing this is just a wall of... Yep, that's that's a wall of no thank you. Got it. So where do I go here? You know, this is where I'm kind of stuck. Can't go in the turbine room.
<clears throat> so how do we go to the safe? That's the question, right? Maybe we can't go to the safe yet? safe in the field training obstacle course. Okay. So this this goes over here and then I lose my map and then I can't go any further cuz I can't fly. Not far enough anyway. I'm thinking this is some place that I just am not supposed to be at yet cuz there's there's no like Yeah, there's not really anything I can do here right now. I'm going to come back to it later. Okay. Hmm? Why are you blinking up there? Stop that. <laughs> I don't like blinkies. Alright. Uh, okay, we explored there. Um, we haven't been over by the NSC coolant pumps again. I guess I could go that way. Yeah, let's head back that way. Um, back to the coolant pumps, please. Thank you. This is the control room, energy converters. I don't think that's gonna take me where I really wanna be. It might. I don't think it will. Yeah, we went through here recently. Can't do anything in there. Come on. Yes, yes, you all have a lot to say. I noticed. Whoops, hi there, how you doing? Oh dear. Ow! That hurt. Come play. I have trash cans for you. You quite done? You're not done. Oh, uh, that's a grenade thrown by you, but... <sighs> Sit down. Cut it out. Okay, good. There's another ritual impulse. Um, let's see. So, in here, I don't... There was a room in the back. Maybe I can go in that room in the back somehow. I didn't really try that. Or at least it looked like there was a room in the back. Maybe there isn't. The map is very confusing. Um, that, I think, is through ventilation, not through here. So, maybe I can't do anything else here. Since we did all the energy stuff already. You seem humming pretty happy to me, so okay, we'll continue on. Um, this leads to the control room, sure. Eh, okay. What's this? Oh, hello. Oh, where's this gonna take me? Let's find out. Oh, okay. Floor three, Black Rock Quarry. Let's go to floor three. I think we'll find out pretty quickly if this is somewhere we're supposed to be or not. Okay, one way out only. Cool. Oh, hello. Always gotta investigate the stairwells. Is this gonna... Oh, level 5 clearance. Can't go that way. Alright. Funny how I'm the director and yet I don't have access to things. Okay, can't go any of those ways right now. Good to know! Let's go ahead and head back down to the first floor. 
Because why not? Um, hmm. Yeah, I wish the maps were rotatable or reorientable. That would help a lot. As it stands, I just end up not really being able to do a lot. Okay. Hello. Oh, we're back at the power plant. Okay. And that's the energy converters. Okay. Cool. That's central maintenance. Okay. So, how do I get up there? Is Do I take these stairs over here? Are there stairs over here? Looks like there should be stairs over here. Or something. Gotta get to the second floor somehow of the... That kinda goes up. That extremely goes up over here. Maybe I can climb this. That won't let me jump that. Um, maybe I can jump this. There we go, thank you. Okay. Yeah, there's no climbing that. Um... Yeah, we're just back around in the same circle again. Okay. Uh, I want to go by the coolant pumps room. So let's head over there. Yeah, this is the direction to go. Coolant pumps. Oh, friends. Big booms. Ow! Shiza. That hurt. Just a little bit. Oh, hey, how you doing? No, you love to have your... Oh, Jesus. Those things are heat-seeking? What the hell? Alright. Sure. That's fine. Where'd you go? There you are. A lot of you are. Jesus Christ. Blow yourselves up, why don't you? Ah, enough. Getting annoyed. Okay, then. Thanks for that. Jeepers. Oh, this leads to the furnace chamber. Okay. Now we're we're making progress. Sure. Oh, did I check this out? Pretty sure I had. Okay. Just making sure. Never know. Okay, we can't do the training course, so let me change my missions back over to this. Thanks, yeah. Cool. Uh-huh. That's the furnace chamber, which we completely skipped last time. Good times, friend. I'm supposed to clean up trash? Burn trash. So... Okay. Hello. My name is Dr. Pierce, lead researcher of the Parakinesiology Department. I believe I've discovered a code Omega paranatural entity residing within the Bureau itself. Right under our noses. Darling refused to allocate me the budget or resources, so so I'm taking matters into my own hands. Let this recording be the proof I need to convince them. The furnace can speak. It's been talking to me for some time now. Listen. Did you hear that? It's a sentient force capable of communicating. I checked, and, and there's no record of, of ever installing this furnace. I believe it. Oh, oh, sorry. What? Yes, I can feed you. Um, 
What do you eat? I see. Uh, I'll try to find some volunteers. Oh my. Okay. It says burn the trash in the furnace, but there's no, like, trash. Burn the trash around the furnace? Oh. Okay. What trash, though? Like, you need to be more specific. Is this the trash? By trash, did Ati mean barrels full of hazardous biological material? Yeah, that would be nice and clear. Thank you. Looks like I'm breaking some environmental regulations on waste disposal, but if that's what Ati wants, then I'll get it done. Oh, hey, there's something over there. We'll, we'll go there in a moment. Yes, let's clear the waste disposal stuff. Here, go fly. Oh, that didn't hit. I missed. Not gonna be winning a game of basketball in this one. That was trash. I got it in there. Okay. Probably could have done this on the first pass if I had actually bothered to go this way, but, you know, it's fine. Never mind the biohazardous waste container. This is totally fine. We handle all things safely within normal protocol levels. Everything is fine. Totally fine. Uh, now I gotta find more trash. Um, is there trash down? Can I go down? It looks like I can go down, but the question is, can I come back up? That's, that's what the problem is. Okay. I don't see any more. Yeah, I see you. I know you're there. Like, whoops. Nope. Oh, okay. Sure. We can't jump that. Okay. Down we go. Ow. Thanks for the goodies. Launch efficiency. Is this trash? Doesn't appear to be. Are there elevators? Are there, there, like, staircases? Sort of. Okay. But how do we get back up? That's the problem. Right? Oh, hello. Oh, there is a stairwell. Haha. <laughs> I, I it, pretend to be a smart person sometimes. A little bit of observation always helps. Okay, there's another piece somewhere I gotta get rid of. We, Oops. Okay, there was a document here. What does this say? Mail tube complaint. Hey, Bozer. Get this. The accounting department still says they haven't received my expense reports. They say the receipts probably got lost in the mail tubes because of a shift or threshold or some fuck raid. And that if I don't have the originals, they can't verify my expenses for reimbursement. This is such bullshit. Why do we even have these fucking tubes if they just spit our mail out in some other goddamn dimension? <sighs> Just venting here before I make a formal complaint. Useless piece of shit. Rodriguez. Oh wait, there was something else there. A multimedia? Oh, this is the tape that I already listened to. Okay. I certainly hope that throwing all of this nuclear waste into this furnace doesn't get me killed because something awakens and becomes, you know, a friend forever. Okay, there's one more barrel somewhere. Question is where? Where is it? Oh, there's the radio. <laughs> we can actually climb that. Maybe I can take this and move it? Not really. Okay. It was a thought. There's one more barrel hiding somewhere. There's also that, which... Oh, there's the barrel. Beautiful. <laughs> there you go. 
Yeah, yeah, I did it. Two ability points received. Nice. That was worth it. I want to go over there, though. Even if I can. I don't know if I can. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Okay, let me... Um... Okay, we can kind of do that. It's not great. What's this? Just more barrels. Okay. Uh, I, I, I think there's a double jump that I don't have yet. That means I'm just not meant to, like, you know, go up there right now. So, we'll call it good for now. Um, yeah, that's a whole... I'm going to guess I'm not allowed to go there yet. All right. Just going to make an assumption. Uh, I think we can go ahead and spend some points, maybe. Let's take a look. Um, I have two points, which means I can unlock more launch damage. I can unlock more melee damage, and that's about it. So let's go ahead and throw some launch damage on the table, which is always good, cause since I use that ability quite a bit. Um, and then can I unlock this new form? I can. I have enough now. So let's upgrade the grip. Uh, unlock the second mod slot, increase the base weapon damage. Beautiful. Oh, hold. Okay. Sweet. Okay, that's all I can do right now, I think. I don't need any of these other mods, so... Cool. Let's go ahead and take a look at our weapons, since I now have two mod slots. On the grip. Uh, I can throw exclusive ammo refund chance or more damage boost. Those are all spin items, spatter spin. Uh, ammo refund on hit. Yeah, that's that, that's very, very little, though. More base damage would probably be more useful. Yeah, let's just boost damage for the sake of things. Uh, lots and lots of these. Okay, let's nuke that one. Let's nuke that one. Energy. Yeah, we'll keep the rest. Okay. Cool. Uh, yes, this is the way I want to go, I think. Yes, indeed. I know we're retreading a bit of, of things from what I did last week, but I am getting more stuff because I'm retreading things, so in the end, it's kind of worth it. Um... Okay. Now we're at the coolant pumps, which we had already done previously. Hopefully friends don't come back to- Nope, they came back! They totally came back. Come here. You'll do. Hey, how you doing, friend? Anybody else want to play? Are we done here? Oh, god, above me. What the heck? Where is the- oh, below me. Okay. Now are we done? Maybe. Okay, pipe works is that way. There's something over to that side that I haven't seen yet. Let's try going up there. Yes, lots of lots of chattiness, thank you. Alright. There is a water coolant system. Yes, here we go. Okay, maybe there's not maybe it's below? No, it doesn't appear to be below. Oh, way up there. Oh, there's like a... Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I think this is more can't do right now stuff. Okay. Bummer, because that looked like it would be cool if I could go there. Um, Something over in this corner? Because there's a little passage that's like question marks over here. It seems to be below. Uh, 
that's just a bunch of other stuff that I don't need to go in there again. Uh, hello? Yeah, it's like there's a there's a passage hidden over here, but I can't see or get to it right now, so Yeah, can't do anything with any of that. All right. Enough of me digging around trying to see if I can do stuff. Can't fly. So can't do things. It's just how it is. I mean, eventually I'll get up there, I'm sure, but that's a ways in the future, I think. How else would I get over there? I'm just gonna take one last look at something here. Okay, because it sees the edge, and then there's like a, a wall. There's no corridor or anything behind it. Okay. There's no down separate path. Okay, yeah, no. I don't, I don't think that's... That's the actual water source. Okay. Nah, we're just gonna go back. I think I've done enough. Let's go back to Central, shall we? Up a daisy. Think that's the which direction are we gonna go out of? Yeah, here we go. Alright. Excuse me. Hi there. Hopefully things don't attack you. Did I open this? I'm pretty sure I opened this previously, but Nothing in there. Okay, already did that. Uh, okay. Ventilation. Power plant. Beeps. Always beeps. Janitor's office, right. Energy converters, coolant, ventilation, sure. Hey, how's it going? I did your job thing that you asked me to. You happy with that? Yes, no, maybe, kind of, sort of, not really. Okay, glad we had that chat. Take care. <laughs> sure. This is fine. No, wait, this isn't the way I want to go. This is the way I want to go. Oh, jeez. Okay, hello. We got friends. There you are. Hey. Uh, I need another thing to throw, please. You all quite done? Good. Glad we had that talk. Thanks for the goodies. Yeah, it seems like, again, there's a little map piece here that's that's missing. Like, over in this corner that I can't get to. It was just like the energy converter stuff, so... I, I'm gonna drive myself... A little... Much, if I keep trying to get into these areas that very clearly I'm not meant to access yet, so... I should just 
Call it good and move on. Yeah. Why are you making a noise? There's something here. Oh, yeah. Central area. Huh? How come this is locked? Oh, is this the... Okay, yeah. Alright, let's just teleport. Because why not? We'll fast travel back to Central Executive and say hi to... There we go. We've returned! Hello. Obviously, you never read the P6 data. Yeah, you want to see me do it? I'll, I can grab something and, and just show you, you know, that I can launch stuff. It, it's pretty cool. Yeah, okay. Glad we had that chat. Jesse, you made it. I did indeed. And you lifted the internal lockdown. Indeed, I did. Let's talk, Emily. Yeah, let's talk. Yes, of course. Let's talk. Listen, Emily. Screw it. Just tell her. I haven't been completely honest. I have a younger <laughs> brother. Dylan. When we were kids, we found an old slide projector in Ordinary's landfill. The slides created... doorways to other places. Bad things happened. Came through. That's all she gets. The rest stays locked inside. But we found help. Through one of the doorways, we... met something. A being. Oh look, it's us, the player. A being? What kind of being? It's hard to describe, but it... She helped us. What's up? We managed to turn the projector off. The bad things that came through the doorways were gone. After that, your people came, tried to grab us. I ran away. They got Dylan. I left them behind. Bureau agents took your brother? Yes. You covered it up. No one believed me. I just want to find Dylan. I've been looking for him ever since. What happened to the slide projector? It sounds like another object of power. I thought you took it. The Bureau. Along with Dylan. I've never heard of it. But around here, I assume everything's classified. You know, I looked into the ordinary AWE case files after you mentioned it. Trench and Darling were both involved. A large area of the containment sector was reserved for it. The case hasn't been active for a long time. I have no idea if anything's still there. Can you tell me more about this being you found? Let's hope you two get along. She's been with me ever since ordinary. In my head. She led me to you. I call her Polaris. As in, a guiding star. Did Polaris know about the Hiss? If she got you in here, in spite of the lockdown, she's very powerful. Which may help explain your test results. Your readings are incredible, Jesse. Now, cross-referencing them with the database, I found two matches in Darling's old classified files. Unfortunately, I can't access them beyond the file codes, but one was P6, referring to a prime candidate for a potential future bureau director. Oh, hey, it's me. Uh, this was logged years ago. Dylan. No, it's you. Dylan? No, it's you. The other match is on something called Hedron, which must be connected to these Hedron resonance amplifiers somehow. All I know is that Marshall went to the research sector to secure the HRA production after the his first attacked. 
So, Marshall seems like our best lead on Dylan. I need to go after her. How can I get to the research sector? Use my key card. The sector elevator will take you there. Oh, now you give this to me. Thanks. Sure. Marshall is the next step. What Emily told me about ordinary, my powers being connected to things in the Bureau's past. I am so close to something. Do you feel it? Something's coming. We take turns to come for a visit. I helped you. You owe me now. And when time comes, I will come calling. Oh, nice. Four ability points. More stuff. Old Boys Club. Okay. Maintenance sector targets. Major targets. What's this? Hold on a sec. It just dumped a bunch of stuff in my missions list. Um, major targets go to the NSC energy converters. I have 19 minutes to do that and change. Okay. Hotline. New hotline. The hiss. All right, let's take a look. Sure, I can help with that. I don't mind that. So we got to go, I guess, to um, NSC Energy Converters. And then... What's, what's this? I have a new personal mod. Launch energy cost is decreased. Yeah, we don't. Alright, so I got to... All but real quick and go do this thing that I only have 20 minutes to do. But we can level up some abilities. Launch grenades and rockets back at enemies. That could be useful. More energy is also really useful because it means I can boost more often. 50% um, more launch damage. I could get both of these or I could get one of these. I'm going to get some more energy, I think. But I have to use four and I get a whole new mod slot. So maybe it's worth doing... Uh, I don't want it to force launch basic enemies when your health is low. Wow. Large objects, huh? Launch up to three objects. Energy recovers. Well, oh, gosh. I like launching things a lot, so I don't know. I think I'm just going to sit on that until I get one more point, and then I can do... Um, actually, you know what? I'm just going to do this. Give me more energy. And we'll get one more somewhere else at some point. No more weapon forms. I don't want to buy random mods. In person? In okay. Person. With a pencil and paper. Fast travel, please. We need to go to the energy converters. Okay. I don't know what it wants us to do here, but we'll find out quickly enough. And Polaris. Name is Polaris. Okay. We are at the NSC energy converters. So what am I doing here? Eliminate key hiss targets, okay. Oh, that's a lot. Let's play. Ah, oh, that didn't work. Hold on, hold on. Ow, 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 ow. Big ow. Okay, cool. Jump. Move, please. Thank you. Oh, God. Okay, good. Definitely need health. Please. Thank you. Oh, God. Here. 
This thing's refund health. That sucks. Oh, there's a there's a friend. Oh god. Oh god. Run. Please run. Thank you. We need to use heavier things against these things because this is annoying as heck. Come here. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Boom. Good. Yeah, switch guns, please. Ow. Okay, this isn't good. This thing keeps recharging before I can take it out. Okay, good. Sheepers. <sighs> Give me some health, please. Where's all the health? Oh, God, there's no health anywhere. That's not good. That's very not good. Give me something to hit, please. Ow, 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 ow. <sighs> I know you're over there. Come on, isn't there health somewhere that- Oh, Jesus, I'm dead. Okay. <sighs> Alert failed. Lovely. Okay, well, I tried. That's really difficult. Like, I don't... Hmm. I feel like I need more abilities to, to do that one. Can I not do that anymore? Is it too late now? It's like, that's it. It failed. The end. Yeah, I guess that's it. Okay. Bummer. Well, I can get that at least, so. Yes, please. Thank you. Uh, kill enemies with pierce. Using pierce, kill enemies, and maintenance. Ah, uh, yeah, we don't. So. Alright, so it wants us to go to... We'll just go back to central, and then we'll warp from... We'll take the elevator from there to the next sector. I think that'll do the job. Alright, so get some personal mods. Evade energy cost is decreased, yeah. Twenty-eight percent versus twenty-six percent. Commercial research sector. Fund. No. That could be useful. Actually, I probably should have used the shattered gun, but... I also have the Sector 3 um, key now, but I don't know if there's any Sector 3 doors that I can go through. And I don't really want to waste my time running around at the moment, so we're just going to go for the elevator and see where it takes us. We can go Research Maintenance, Maintenance Sector Access Containment. All right, we're just going to go to research since that's what's on the docket here. Hmm. Hmm, okay. Welcome to research. Yep. Here we are. Oops. Sorry, didn't mean to mess that up. Oh, hello. make for great internal communications. I'm looking at you, Mr. Tomasi. So, this is where the magic happens. Anyway, I, I've been here for 24 years now. I've always been here. And, and through those years, we've made astonishing discoveries, authored studies of great importance, and in all this work, there is one thing we know, and that's how little we truly know. Rest assured, we're committed to keep pushing the known laws and borders of reality, and to make the Bureau proud. So, welcome. Assuming you have the necessary clearance, and, and do follow the safety protocols. Read the manual. Otherwise, bad things will happen. Cheapers. 
Okay, Research that's fine. Sector, huh? Yeah. Home of the Bureau's mad scientists. Okay. Hello. Complaint, complaint. Okay. Complaint. Hey, so I was just wondering about the plants and research. Is it really necessary to sing to them? I mean, that janitor does have a nice voice and the plants sure seem to like it. Maybe he could just switch it up a bit. I'm getting pretty tired of the tango. Where did these plants even come from? No one seems to remember when they were planted and people like them a bit too much if you ask me. Are we being invaded by houseplants? It's worth looking into, Dr. Lewis. Okay, friend. Yes, Darling's presentations on the research sector. Yes, I know that I have missions, thank you. Oops. Dr. Darling's, uh, oh, hello. That's not good. <laughs> that That's distinctly not good, I think. Hey, how y'all doing? Don't mind me, just... Hanging out. Synchronicity. A glimpse into the paranatural synchronicity and the unseen connection. Synchronicity is a phenomenon long recognized by the wise, but only recently given a name by science. It is how we rationalize events connected by no identifiable causality, yet clearly conjoined in purpose. How does a dream foretell an event in the physical plane? Why do hounds bail at the death of their master, which has occurred miles away? The world is unified in ways we do not yet understand, and sometimes we stumble across these invisible unseen cords and wonder at the result. The visionary Carl Jung laid the road, now we must walk it. My fledgling research department will make it our mission to reliably reproduce behavior by the close of 1959. Once done, the mechanics of synchronicity will lay themselves bare in due time. We are striding into the future of science. History may not remember our names, but God himself will. Refer to file uh, for full report. Why is there just like a bed? That must be from the, the one place? Okay. You, uh, you have a good conversation with yourselves there. Okay, we can't go that way. I am going to go downstairs. I uh, don't think I have a map. Oh, I do have a map of the area. Never mind. Okay. Oh, yes, lovely. One. Refresh, please, thank you. Okay, here comes the biggins. Come on. Let's play. More. There's a whole bunch of them down there. Okay. Those snipers? I think they are. Oh yeah, those are snipers. Okay. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna borrow this chair for a little bit. It'll be fine. Grenade. This is fine. Oh, big bang. Okay, we didn't need that anyway.
Yeah, snipers. There it is. We'll look at the research in a moment here. I'm just going to pick up all these goodies that dropped first. Which is not that much, actually, it seems. Okay. Oh, a few. It's fine. Don't freak out on me, please. Energy mods. All right. You. Leave me alone. All right. Yes, snipers. Lovely. Bureau snipers specializing in specialize in eliminating threats from a distance using the telltale searchlights affixed to their rifles to search for targets. The snipers are no less lethal. Their corruption has not changed their tactics. They clearly prefer to maintain a good distance from their target, waiting in elevated positions for a clear shot. Care should be taken in open spaces. Check the balconies. I should note that their rifles are equipped with a bayonet for close quarters combat, and the snipers are well aware of how to use it. Refer to this file for the further report. Okay, we now have more assets. Uh, and still more personal mods that we cannot install. I'm just going to let these continue to accumulate for the time being. Hello. For who among us has touched the foundations of this world and deemed them solid? Well, not me, apparently. Hello. Ooh, that's not good. Threshold utility. Utilization of paranatural elements, thresholds. Thresholds have always been sources of great inspiration and great challenge. When a new threshold manifests in the oldest house by eh, we never know what new discoveries it will provide to the Bureau, but we must always seize these opportunities. This report will examine the process of distinguishing recent threshold effects based on the utilitarian possibilities. The quarry brought black rock, one of our most invaluable discoveries, but if the mold has any scientific value, it has been difficult to fine due to the lengths we must go to in fighting back the particularly prolific plant. There's a very distinct cases and worth comparing to the as their studies offer vastly different dangers and rewards. Refer to file 5-94-1284 for full report. Alright. Right. Black mold, huh? Is it harmful? Doesn't appear harmful. It's just kind of there. Can't activate that. Okay. Interesting. Sealed and done. Cool. I have no clue where I'm going. Just kind of meandering around, seeing where I end up. Uh, acoustic research. Okay. Thanks for the goodies. Song questionnaire. Auditory Experience 84C, Poets of the Fall, My Dark Disquiet. Answer questions within two minutes of listening. Did the song elicit any particular memories? If so, elaborate. Did you at any point feel a strong emotion? If so, elaborate. What emotion? Did a clear image of a weapon appear to your mind during the song? If so, elaborate. Provide a detailed description of your current surroundings as you see them. Have you ever heard the murmur of voices when no one is present? If so, what did they say? Do you hear them now? Please choose one of the following from each pairs. One or two, A or B, day or night, apple or orange, burn out or fade away. Okay. Hmm. Nice, they actually did a really good job of acoustically dampening the room when you're in it. That's kind of cool. Poets of the Fall, My Dark Disquiet. <laughs> okay. We have to listen to the whole song. So the question is, by doing this, do we then, you know, have to... Music. It's 
a really nice sound system. Like, look at the size of those things. Okay. Thanks. Cool. Hopefully that doesn't get me copyright striked. Alright. Let's see here. So that took me downstairs. This is just taking me back up to the main level. Sorry, friend. Looks like you almost made it, too. Eh? Well, that's not a good sound. Always worries me that something's gonna get into these shelters. That is not a good sound. Okay, I'm back here again. Alright, we've kind of come full circle on that particular area. Now, what does... There was... wasn't... hold on. There was a safety thing I didn't open back here, which I... Oh, hello! How you doing? Good to see you. Oh, nice. Yes. Awesome. Oh, that was a big fall. Whoops. Not intentional. Oh, you are actually shooting at me. Hold on. Surprise! Okay, yeah, this is the one I hadn't gone into yet. Okay. Hello. Emergency call summary. NAAW18, a possible AWE in which an unnamed individual experienced transcorporeality via a phone line. Event is nobly similar to AWE in which event is believed to have been caused by and as a result of the following measures have to be taken. Uh, 1993, 617. I don't know the significance of that. Maybe it's an Alan Wake reference. Who knows? Okay. Oh man, I, d I was just wanting to get some food. Why do you gotta come back? Cheaper, seriously. Uh oh. The fact that they regenerate health is probably the most annoying part of this entire ordeal. What did you just do? What? Okay. whipping around and stuff. What's up with that? That is new. Okay. I don't know what that was about, but sure. Here, have a big seat. Oops, that didn't work at all. Oh, you're a big one. That's not good. Come on. Alright, we killed the his trooper. Yay. Yeah, I just want a boiga. Can I get a boiga? Hello. Black Rock Analysis. Hi, Carla. Does it strike you odd that Darling insists on having us appear in those bizarre videos of hers? I mean, we just stand there. He doesn't even let us have lines or anything. Don't get me wrong, beats a day in the lab. Plus, it's always great to work with you. 
Oh yeah, I finished the comparative analysis of the two Blackrock samples you sent. The prism, or whatever you called it. I filed them in the usual place under C for Carla. Handy mnemonic device, right? Huh. Anyway, uh, let me know if there's anything you want to discuss about the data. I'll gladly explain. Maybe we could chat about it over some drinks, or dinner even. I can't remember the last time I had a good steak. Maybe we could go together after work sometime. I'm free tomorrow. All the very best, Hubert. Okay, Hubert, don't stretch yourself too far there. Welcome to the cafeteria, where you can sit down, enjoy some lunch, and relax to some heavy beats from our wonderful radio system. Um, sorry for the mess. Did I check this shelter? I feel like, yes, I did. Okay. Yeah, and that's the tubes and the weird hisses over there. And why is it acting like there's something in that corner? Okay. Yes, hiss, hiss, hiss. So there's got to be a way to clear the black mold so that we can go down without dying um, so that we can activate that later. So that's gotta that's gonna have to happen later. Um Oops, sorry. Sorry. Didn't didn't mean to make a mess, sorry. Is there something over here or is this just restrooms? This is just restrooms. Very large restrooms, but still just restrooms. Alright, I feel like if I don't open every one of these I'm gonna miss something, so. Come on. Oh, sorry, sorry, so, sorry. Shoot. Tap the wrong button and just... Sorry, I'll, I'll go clean up. Sorry. Gosh. I'm always making a mess of things. Oh, hello. See? Okay, it's just going to tell me if something's there. That's useful. Maybe I don't need to go opening things. Pierce aimed. I still don't have the pierce weapon, though. Can't do anything without the pierce weapon. Or I can't apply pierce boosts without the pierce weapon. Modern, avoid modern technology. Is that a stapler or an altered item? Oh, come on, I just... Ugh. Oh god. Ah, jeez, that hurt. Okay, yeah, there's another one. Thanks for that. Getting really sick of these guys that I can't do a lot of damage to. What? Was behind me for a second there. Okay. Hi. Ow. Ow. I'm running into the darn things. Come on, Jesus Christ. What's this thing's story? Like, I don't get what those are about. Is it just like a weird... Right. I'm out of energy. Lovely. All right. Need health, please. And which gun am I on? On the shatter one. Okay. Cheapers. Do not let up, do you guys? Am 
My goodness. Well, I was trying to keep the cafeteria nice so that y'all could just sit down and enjoy some food, but... No, you all just had to, to go and make a mess of it. Yeah, okay. Great. I guess we'll go back upstairs now. Gosh. Spin mods, huh? Consecutive kills, spin rate of fire boost. It would be nice to be able to shoot faster. Um, 23%, but accuracy is better. Controlled bursts. Yeah, maybe that's what I'm doing wrong. Well, let's try a faster rate of fire and see what that does for a little bit. We could also try a different personal mod. Whoops. Um, this has just been that. Having a bit more energy would be good. Evade energy cost is lowered. Launch energy cost. Just having more energy. 7% energy boost? Yeah, sure. Oh, this is the entrance. Okay. Was there a point of uh, control anywhere around here? I don't think there was. Ah! The ritual division is a no-go. I don't know why I didn't notice that the first time when I came in. Interesting. All right, we'll go upstairs then. What could possibly go wrong? Hello, Dr. Darling's office. Yes, sure. And dimensional research. Well, I guess we're going to Dr. Darling's office. Hello. All kinds of goodies in here, I'm sure. Cubes, cubes, cubes. Astral plane. Uh, no, that's the one. Okay. The Bureau has spent years studying why objects of power transport users into the astral plane when touched. My predecessor, Dr. Ash, theorized that a potential receptacle, determined by Jungian archetypes and the collective subconscious, would be inhabited by paranatural energies when an AWE occurred in its vicinity, creating an altered item. Over time, a link was created by the Ent in the astral plane to that item, making it an object of power. So many additional theories have been raised since Dr. Ash's time. Objects of power were placed on Earth as tests by some astral entity. Our dimension was once part of the astral plane, and the objects were left behind as its borders receded. The astral plane was an early threshold into the oldest house, but the connection was severed, and now the two are linked solely through the object's power. I will attempt to disprove some of these in order to thun the herd. Hopefully the truth will emerge. Refer to file 6-326498. More information. Budget request. Dear Dr. Darling, I suspect my colleague, Dr. Harrington, has already contacted you asking for an increase in our department's budget. I'm not surprised. Parapsychology has always been the squeaky wheel, all fuss, but no results. Parakinesiology has always been the stronger department. More breakthroughs, more tangible data, more usable research. I'm sure a man of your esteem can plainly see which department is more deserving of the budget increase. Just think what those additional resources could do for an already formidable research team. Anyway, I know you're a fan of single malt, so I left a bottle of well-edged brown on your desk. Yours in admiration, Dr. Abraham Lewis. What a suck-up. What is it giving me HRAs? Oh, we'll watch that presentation in a minute here. What's the deal with the headroom? All right. Resonance theory. Utilization of paranatural elements resonance. Resonance, it's there, but we can't see it. It vibrates around us, through us, from us. But what if the vibration is conscious? What could a force like that do? Eh, open the door to it. Eh, I've called eh. The eh emits a force that is far beyond the forces we previously dealt with. It has shown me so much that I have to wonder. Is resonance the key element in all altered phenomena? AWEs, altered items, objects of power? Do they share a common eh that we've yet to discover? We can harmonize control points. What else could the, would the correct frequency allow us to achieve? What if resonance has been the answer this whole time? Okay. 
So Dr. Darling may have walked too close to the sun. He's drunk off his butt in that video. We'll watch it in a minute here. Astral Plane Counter Essay. Dr. Darling is insistent that certain objects of power share a direct connection to the uh, an entity or group of entities that we have little information on or little that I'm allowed to access. In his written reports, he states that there is a clear link between these objects of power, the, uh, the astral plane, and the oldest house itself. <clears throat> his work surpasses these links, supposes these links are innate, in fact ingrained into the very uh, of objects such as the hotline or the surface weapon. But if these particular objects were never linked to the eh, but had that connection, but had that, uh, but had that connection forced upon them, isn't it strange that no other objects of power require such direct contact with the eh? Isn't it strange that using the service weapon or the hotline would result in grievous harm or even death if the user is not the director or at least worthy of the role? Why do we assume this involvement by the eh is a natural fact and not something more eh? Hmm. <laughs> tick, 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 tick. You do that regardless whether or not you're wearing an HRA. <laughs> Think of them as, uh, as a uh, life preserver. Only instead of water, the, the thing HRAs protect you from is um, classified. One day that classified not water might pour in and you'll be glad you got a got an hra keeping you afloat and if you don't have an hra don't worry it'll be uh quick and painless <laughs> kidding i'm kidding we're making more well Oh, I don't know why I just looked at that. So we're talking fourth dimensional objects here. This is this is the kind of the implication of all of these various things is uh, yeah fourth dimensional stuff. So let's take a look at the um, video for that. There we go. I've been fielding questions recently regarding HRAs. What are they for? Do you always need to wear them? And what's the deal with the headroom resonance anyway? I... Fuck. <laughs> Despite what you may have heard, HRAs are not monitoring devices. We're not tracking your movements or listening to your conversations while you're wearing them. <laughs> we do that regardless whether or not you're wearing an HRA. Think of them as, uh, as a uh, life preserver. Only instead of water, the, the thing HRAs protect you from is um, classified. One day that classified not water might pour in and you'll be glad you got a, got an HRA keeping you afloat. And if you don't have an HRA, don't worry. It'll be uh, quick and painless. <laughs> kidding. I'm kidding. We're making more. Well... You saw it was coming, saw something could happen, and acted on it, but might not have been far enough. Is there anything else in here? Okay, let's, let's... No more. Okay, that was Dr. Darling's office, thank you for that insight. Dimensional research. Okay. Beep beep. Oh, whoa. Didn't expect that, I just expect a beep beep. 
Also, how do I get to that security room? I don't think I can. All right, I'm the director, let me in. Yes? Okay, this is a bridge I can cross. Excellent. Fire break. Oh god, okay. What do you have to say about dimensional research? Hold on. The ashtray maze? Okay. I'm averse to using objects of power. I don't want to lean on things I ultimately can't trust. But the ashtray and the cigarette, smoking there forever, have their uses. The ashtray maze they conjure is an impossibly changing labyrinth that no one but the binder and those the binder invites can ever pass through. The things we hid in dimensional research, the things Darling studies, the danger and the risk involved, call for every measure of security and protection I could bring to the table. The maze hands down, is our strongest lock. I gave Darling and his chosen crew license to pass through the maze. Lately, I've started to think I should revoke that license. Well, you're a bit late on it now, friend. Sorry. Ashtray, huh? I am in the ashtray maze, an unknown, unknown of an unknown. Me? Okay. Danger, open pit. Okay. Me? Oh, it's just closing. Okay. Whoa, hello. Okay. Ah, yes, things have closed. Lovely. Okay. Sure. What? What are you sparking about? Okay. The way out or the way in? I have a feeling this is just going to lead me in a circle for the time being, so... Oh, hello. Cool. Thanks for the goodies. Astro blips. Yeah, we're going to... Whoa. A little bit of a problem there. It's just going to lead me in circles for the time being, I think. All right, can't go that way yet. Good to know it's there, though. Thanks for the entertainment. Whoop, nope, set it off anyway. Thought I'd try something different, it didn't exactly work. Okay, so we gotta go out of way. I think. There's not much else we can do at this point. Um, yeah. I feel like there's... Oh, great. Okay, thanks for that. Again. Hmm. Is 
So I have to go this way. Like, there's no other route to go through. It doesn't want to let me through, though. So what am I supposed to do? Like, that's the route I need to go in. Um. Okay, let me... We did that, thank you. Old Boys Club. People from... Yes, Marshall and Nate know more about in the research sector. We're in the research. Go to pneumatics. I don't know where pneumatics is in the executive. Okay. Don't really want to do that right now. Um... Okay. Yeah, let's play Shatter for a bit. Why not? Um, recoil, damage after kills, accuracy, projectile choke, projectile boost. Oh, that just kind of pissed it off. Okay. Yeah, great. Nothing spawned behind me, okay. Oh, Jesus, what? Oh, what are you? You're new. Ow! Okay, can't do that. But I can certainly shoot you. Oh, Jesus. Okay, let's get some health, please. Thank you. Yeah, great. More? God, now what? one of those even better oh there's something up there I didn't notice that previously yeah we don't have time to get that right now but that's fine and we gotta fight one of these things lovely God. <laughs> what? More? Jesus crud. Ow. Oh dear. Yes, please blow each other up. Thank you. Are we quite done here? I uh, guess not. Oh god. Forgot this tracked. Okay. We done? Oh my gosh. It's just never ending. Why 
All right. So, I feel like I've, I've I've searched the entire area, but I can't figure out how to progress any further because the elevator down here can't be used, and I can't, um, you know. Thanks. Maybe the trees? To do with some of the trees? No. Yeah, I'm gonna go back up to the main research or the main area, um, and take a moment because I've certainly taken a lot of hits from everything attacking me. Oh gosh, darn it! Come on, I just want to leave. out of here while we can before more stuff attacks me. Please. Yeah. That doesn't seem to be getting me anywhere. Let's go back to executive. Take a moment to heal up. National constructs. Can we get a new weapon? Construct Pierce requires way more. Oh, just a little bit more. Cool. Penetrates armors and enemies at range. That's good to know. I would like to unlock that, please. Mods. Can't get any mods. You mean like in Can't do any abilities because I need more. Oh, I could unlock this. A little bit more melee damage. Why not? That gives me an additional personal mod slot, which is always good. I could have done that a while ago. Person? Probably would have been much happier with it. Yes, we did this. Thank you. All right, Pierce can't do. <sighs> Hiss elevated. Gravity restriction is king of them. Kill Hiss elevated. Sure. And the executive shatter using shatter. Oh, no, we don't want to do that, I think. With a pencil and paper. I think she's trying to get us killed. All right, so, um... Yeah, executive good pneumatics, I know. Now I can add an additional personal mod, which is nice. So, um... Don't want that. All the level one stuff is like, eh. Twenty-eight percent, twenty-six percent. Launch energy cost minus nine percent. No. Energy flats. Okay. Actually, let's let's drop our energy cost on launch since I use that a lot, and let's. Give ourselves uh, yeah, more, more maneuverability might be nice. Can I organize these? It would be, it would be nice if there was a oh, new rarity type. Shatter recoil efficiency. 
5, 10, 14. We don't need that. 32% damage boost. That's pretty good. Put that on my... Yeah. Accuracy boost might help a little. All right. Need something? Yeah, I'm a little lost. Maybe you can help. Hi, Jesse. Hi. Yeah, Darling and whereabouts. I keep finding traces of Darling, but still can't find him. Where could he be? But he's usually in his office in research or one of his labs. Dr. Darling has quite a few all around the bureau. Could be hiding in any one of them. I check myself, but I don't have access to most of them. Sounds like I touched a nerve. Mm -hmm. He didn't let you into his labs? Not all of them, no. Some had volatile material. It's ridiculous. I mean, this whole place is volatile material. Could have at least thought up a more convincing lie. I mean, how can I work without access to all the data possible? Mm hmm. This place has a bad habit of moving around, huh? So you notice the building shifts. Did you know that 39% of bureau accidents are caused by the shifts? No. It's true. I ran the numbers myself. So they're dangerous. Oh, very. Yet one time, a shark got shifted into a meeting room along with over 2,000 gallons of water. It was a tiger shark, Darling's pet research project. I forget what he was researching. How do people work here? Well, that's... they don't. <laughs> All right. You said you're an assistant? Oh, it's just a title. I'm a scientist, a researcher. I work for Dr. Darling. See, when bureau agents go out in the field, the sites of altered world events, we study the materials, the altered items they bring back. It's always something we've never seen before. And studying them requires new instruments, methodology, sometimes entirely new fields of science. Emily really loves her job. If that wasn't There's apparent no by this point. There's no guidebook for what we do here. Everything that happens at the bureau, including the science, is without precedent. What exactly is the Ocean View Motel? That's a bigger question than you might think. You see, I have extreme doubts that the motel is a single place. I mean, look at all the doors inside it. Where do they all go? We know that one door leads to the oldest house, but how come we can only ever open that one door? Maybe to open a door, you have to have entered through it. So if every door leads to a different dimension, plane, reality, whatever you want to call it, then I believe that the motel is firm proof that parallel universes exist. Does Darling agree with that? I haven't told him yet. I'm waiting until I can prove it. Well, good to have the proof, I guess. What can you tell me about control points? They're nexus points of the oldest house's unique energies. Now, I wrote a 30-page proposal hypothesizing that we could siphon energy directly from them. Darling didn't even get through the first page before he turned it down. Right. And, uh, has anyone ever used them to teleport around? What? Uh, no. What, I mean, you mean physically? Uh, no, not that I've ever heard of. Why? Because that's how they work for me. What? Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. More tests. Uh, no, not more tests. Let's hold off on the tests until later, okay? Yeah. Just, just take it, take it easy. Okay, you know, it's just, wow. I mean, this blows my control point theories right out of the water. I love it. I'm glad that you love science because that's awesome soon. that you love science. Be careful out there. All right. I don't think there's anything else I can do because I can't get into research to do what I want to do in the first place. So. A lot of these questions could be answered by obtaining a live specimen. Oh yeah, a live specimen, sure. All right. With that, unfortunately, we are going to have to wrap it up for the day because I am out of time. But that's okay. I had a good time playing this. Thank you all so much for joining me for today's stream. Got a lot done.
Thank you all so much for joining me for today's stream of Control. We finished up the maintenance sector for the most part and started our way into research. Kind of hit a bit of a brick wall, but I think we'll be able to push past it next time. I will be on this coming Tuesday for Random Game Night and the following Sunday to continue this playthrough of Control. Till next time, take care, stay safe, and as always, Aloha!